Hi everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all doing well. So I have a super exciting video today because we are finally putting up the Christmas tree. It has taken us so long this year. I don't know why, like normally we have it up in November, but it's actually the 1st of December today and we are finally putting it up. So I'm super excited to get it up because I haven't been feeling overly festive. Um, so I feel like once I've got the tree up, I should start to feel festive. So before we get into decorating the tree, I am super excited to say that this small section of the video is very kindly sponsored by one of my favorite brands. And they're a brand that I love to gift around this time of year. And they're also a brand that I love to receive, a brand that I wear a lot. I actually also featured them in my gift guide, uh, which if you haven't seen, I'll pop it down below. But if you haven't already guessed, it is Ugg. Now I love my Uggs. I have Ugg slippers, which I have worn for years and years. I'm literally wearing them right now. Hang on, let me show you them. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so I have my Ugg slippers, which I've worn for years. I also have my Ugg mini boots, which I also wear all the time. They are just the perfect shoe to literally slip on with everything. So easy to wear, so comfortable and so warm, which is so needed around the summer of year. So I recently picked up some new Uggs for myself because my mini ones I was wearing them literally to death. They just look a little bit battered now and I just wanted to get something a little bit different as well. I'm sure you guys will have seen that Uggs are absolutely ever at the minute. They are so cool and on trend. But Hayley Bieber wearing them and also so many of my favourite influencers. Jilly Isabella is one of my favourites and she styles her Uggs so, so well. But anyway, so I decided it's time for me to pick up some fresh ones and I'm super excited because I do feel like these are ones that you can wear, you know, not just sort of for the running errands kind of loungewear days, but they're also ones you can wear with jeans, you can wear like more kind of smarter. That's what I'm loving seeing at the minute is wearing like these with like jeans or leggings and then like a smart coat and maybe a beanie hat or something like that. So you're kind of like bridging that comfy casual gap, which I love. So I decided to pick these ones up. So these are the mini versions and I love these so much and they're also in the leather which basically I just thought would be really nice and durable for the winter months and I also decided to go for the black because I just felt like the black would go with everything so I am so so thrilled with these so I am going to try them on for you guys later uh, and show you what they look like and everything like that when I head out but as I said at the minute I have got my slippers on. <laughs> I also did pick up a little surprise for Sam as well. As I said, Uggs are so great for gifting. I especially think they're really good for gifting the people that you don't know what to buy. You know, maybe people that have got everything or people that are just really tough to buy for. So for example, like my dad's really hard to buy for, my brother. Sam's hard to buy for because I feel like he normally just buys himself what he wants. So yeah, they can be really hard to buy for. So I've bought my dad and my brother uh, Ugg slippers before and I have also brought Sam them. I remember it was our first Christmas together. Uh, so that'd be like seven years ago now and I just had no idea what to get him and I got him on clippers and he literally loved him so much. So anyway, I'm going to go grab him quickly. He's upset. So I'm going to go get him and give him what I picked out for him. Fancy. Yeah, I got you a surprise. Wait, close your eyes. Wait, close your eyes. Close your eyes. Come here. I know. No, no, no. I've got you. I've got you. <laughs> what, am I allowed enough? Yeah, sit down. Are you still with your eyes closed? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just have to sit on the cushion with it. Okay, keep them close, keep them close. Sorry, I did open them, but I didn't see them. Okay. Oh wow, very much in your back. Are they what, still do good? I get to open it? Yeah, you get to open it now. It's a like, <laughs> little early Christmas surprise. What is it, advent it's, calendar? No, I haven't actually got an advent calendar yet. It's actually something that you can wear now. I've just given it away a bit, sorry. Open your bit hands up. What, do it in the tree? Yeah. Or like gloves or something. Ready, three, two, one. Shoes. <laughs> you can open your eyes now. Oh, <laughs> sweet. Come on then. <laughs> Do you like them? Yeah, these are wicked. They're cool, aren't they? Oh, my other ones are a bit battered now. Yeah, because I was just telling them, when did I get you those, those other ones? Oh, you bought me other ones like four years ago? No, I literally got them when we were first together, our first Christmas. I mean... Seven years ago? Yeah, our first Christmas together. Oh, no way. And they're so battered. Oh, these ones have got like more of a heel. So I can like these wear are like, them outside. These are like, oh yeah, these aren't just slippers. These are to wear out and about. Oh, plush. Let me show you the um, camera. Oh, that's why I'm going to take stickers off. So these are the ones that I got for Sam. And wait, just Sorry. a second. <laughs> so the, Sam. <laughs> so these are the ones that I got for Sam. So they're like kind of a combination between like a slipper and a boot, which I like. I just feel like that makes it much more kind of wearable out and about, but you can also wear them around the house as well. Oh, can um, I go outside with wrap and stuff? And I really, I really like this detailing here. Hang on. I really like what this. What size did you get? Um, an 11. Oh, nice. Can I try it on? Yeah, of course. They're yours, one. 
Oh. There was the, no better the feeling. The inside's all fresh. There's no better feeling than putting your feet into a brand new pair of arms. I think you should take socks off. I know my feet are going to be really, really hot. <laughs> Show the camera. Oh, then. I can wear these like. Man, I'm wearing these like to the shops, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. What are that about? Here we go. <laughs> Oh wow. I like the colour. I feel like they're giving you a bit of height. Not that you need it. <laughs> yeah, they've got quite a chunky like sole on them, haven't yeah. they? Yeah. Oh, these are wicked. You like them? Yeah, I like with these. My other ones are brown, aren't they? Mm. Oh, man. These are wicked. Happy Christmas. <laughs> I don't know, how come I got to wear them now, though? Cause... You should have kept them wrapped up. Hey, well, I'll wrap them back up for you if you want. Oh, no. <laughs> Alright then. Oh, buzzer. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> Alright, you're off now, are you? Yeah. You got what you wanted. Got what I came for. <laughs> oh, hey, he's well comfy. Are oh, they? Well, I mean, I'm not surprised because they're literally the comfiest things ever. So, guys, I will leave the Uggs that Sam and I picked up linked down below. But as I said, they really are a great gift for someone if you just don't know what to buy them because you're really hard to buy for. Oh, no, these are real hard you're so hard to buy for, aren't you? You're not going to talk about feet, I don't think. <laughs> but yeah, they're a really great gift, but also a really nice gift for yourself, as I have done too. Look, I've got these. Oh, boot ones. Yeah, they're cool, aren't they? And they're leather. Are they? Yeah. Let me see. Wow. Let me smell them. Oh, it's not nice. Yeah, these smell nice. <laughs> So yeah, as I said, I'll link everything down below, guys. Um, and yeah, now we're going to get on with the tree, which is very exciting. Are you excited to see the tree? Yeah, I am actually. Now that everything's downstairs, I wasn't looking yeah, forward to it. Yeah, Sam threw a little bit of a paddy down. earlier about the uh, tree being down. Yeah, it's the tree it's so heavy. Right, let's get on with decorating. So we have actually decided that before we start decorating the tree, we are going to pop to some shops because I want to go to the garden centre uh, and I just want to have a look around just for some new baubles and stuff. So I just thought we may as well do that now while they're open and then we can decorate the tree like later on this evening when it's dark, we can pop the fire on, all that sort of thing. So yeah, I thought that would be quite a nice thing to do. So I thought I'd show you what I'm wearing. So I have the black jumper dress on from Topshop. My tights are from... Where did I get these from? I can't actually remember now, but they're 15 denier. Then I have this Zara coat on, and then of course, I'm pairing it with my black leather Uggs. I love them so much, so yeah, you can see like the full outfit here. I think they look really cool. Hang on, let me go back a little bit. There we go. So yeah, I'm gonna wear these, and Sam's gonna wear his as well, so we're gonna look like the full Ugg family. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna head out to those shops now. So we are just on our way to Neptune first. Uh, it's actually the most miserable day. It's so annoying uh, because I wanted to get Sam outside putting. That sounded like you farted. <laughs> uh, I wanted to get Sam outside putting some lights up, but I don't think he's going to do it today. It's also really like dark, isn't no way, it? No Doesn't it feel like it could be like six o'clock at night? It's so dark. Uh, so yeah, I will. Neptune's just here, babe. <laughs> um, so yeah, I will show you around if I can. It's cold outside. Keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're around, Everything will be okay Cause all I want to do is spend this holiday with you Tomorrow it is Christmas The first for me and you I longed for this moment This is literally my dream kitchen setup. Like I love the big kind of kitchen area with the big island and the Arga and stuff And then over here you have like the dining area with the double doors. I just think it's so nice. It's literally exactly what I would want. And like all this storage along here, it's just to die for. So nice. So oh, nice. look at this sink as well. You know how nice and that's symmetrical. Yeah, and also just imagine like washing up here, like looking out in the view and stuff. I just want to buy this house. Um, I also love this wrapping paper so much from Neptune, but it's literally like 25 pound for three rolls. I just feel like it's too expensive for wrapping paper, but. I really, really like it. We picked up some foliage because I want to try and do like a bit of a bigger garland on the fireplace than we normally do. So I'm going to try and give it a go with some of these bits. 
So we've just come to a little shop in, sorry I don't know why I'm wearing this on the car. we just come to a little shop in Nutsford called Arthur Lee. I'm just going to have a little quick look in there to see if there's any cute Christmassy bits. I don't know if you can hear me with the road there, but I feel like this is such a cool idea. I really like it. So festive. I love this brand, so nice. I am absolutely in love with this stool. I really, really want it. So nice. I also love these big baubles. All the fire and wall paints. So Sam and I have just fallen in love with these prints. This Vogue one here, and then this one over here. I think it's so cool. I think we're gonna put them in um, like our dark lounge. And we've also fallen in love with this table, but I just think it might be a little bit big for where we need it. So we're gonna go home and measure. No one take this, by the way. <laughs> no one come and buy this, because <laughs> I wanna buy it. <laughs> but yeah, this place is so cool. I love it so much. So that was actually really successful, not for Christmas stuff, but uh, we found two prints uh, that are already framed to pop in our lounge. So very exciting, I'm gonna pop them up. Well, we're not, probably not gonna pop them up, but <laughs> we're gonna see what they look like when we get home. Um, I don't know, we could try and put them up to be fair. I did put up a picture the other day. But it was a lot lighter than them. Anyway, yeah, I think I'd need a drill for that, wouldn't I? Yeah, I would. Anyway, we are now at the garden center, uh, Friars it's called, um, in Nutsford. And we are just gonna have a little look around because like I said, we didn't really get anything Christmassy then. So it's really nice and Christmassy in here. I wanna get some lights and stuff. So we're just coming out of the uh, garden centre now. Me and Sam have an argument in there because he refused to do lights outside our house. Didn't you? Because I what? Because you refused to do lights outside our house. No, you're just making out like it's so easy to whack lights It is outside. easy. Well, well, why didn't you do it then? Because I think it's a job that should be done together, slash mostly you. <laughs> we just need to get a ladder, which we have. Anyway, we had an argument. So, we're not doing the lights outside the house. Let me in. Oh. Let me in. Samuel. Will we do the lights next year, Sam? I'm not committing to this on camera. Please. I've really, I've always wanted to have a house with lights outside it. Please. Thank you. I do you want a little, you a do you want a little garden centre hall? Um, so, first up we got these crisps. Jazzles. These look unreal, slabs they're called. Thick and big, yeah. chunky. No, 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 I wanna show them oh. what we got. Chunky potato crisps, so we got them. Two, two packs then. Mm. Is that what that's called? So we got slabs. these, extra long matches for the fire. And I really like the matchbox, felt like it was very festive. Yeah. Um, I feel like in every single video you are rustling something. Like you're such a little rustler. Russell. <laughs> um, and then we got these baubles, which I thought were really cute. And I also feel like if you were good at art, actually you're good at art, maybe you could do like some oh, no, really. cool drawing. Let me try, let me try. We've got your own bag. No, let me try your bag. I don't open mine yet. Just let me try. <laughs> right, whole potatoes. Wow. That's unreal. As I was saying, if you were good at art, you could get like a real nice like fine liner and do like really nice little drawings on, you know, like um like naked like bodies kind of vibe. Do you know what I mean? You want porn scenes? No, not porn, like artistic, you know, like with the little boobs and like a couple lines and stuff. Anyway, so that's out. <laughs> Flying saucers, these are one of my favourite sweets. Mm. Some more matches. I thought this matchbox was cute. Got this giraffe. A little Santa toy because he doesn't actually have any festive toys. He had a, he had a roast carrot he? and he had a Brussels sprout actually, but he ruined them. Oh, yeah. um, strawberry bonbons. Oh, 
Oh, and we also got these, which actually look a little bit weird here, but in the shop they had them out and they looked so nice. They're like little droplets, so I'm gonna give them a go as well. And then Sam got to their milk bottles. Yeah. yeah, I love milk. These are the worst sweet ever. And that's us. So we need to go oh, back now because look at the size of that. we need to start decorating because it's literally like half past three. We also need to get some lunch. What are you thinking of what we're eating? Oh, we're eating now. What, mm. what should we actually do for lunch? Okay, I'll chat to you on the back. All right, so we are home and we are finally ready to start decorating. So first things first is that I'll give you a little tour of the room without anything in it. And now we can start decorating. So we need to put the tree up. So this is our tree here. It's in two bags. It's from Balsam Hill. It's literally so big. I think it must be like 10 foot or something. But yeah, so we need to get that up, which will take a little while. But I'm gonna set you on a little time lapse and we'll get cracking. Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Hi baby boy! Hi! Hi baby! Hello! What is it? Picking up next day. Yeah. Oh, I'm So some of my absolute fave baubles that I always get asked about are these. So they're from Oliver Bonus, and I don't think they're meant for like the Christmas tree, but I love putting them in the Christmas tree personally. Uh, they're like the little hanging photo frames. Oh, yeah, I like uh, and I just popped a Polaroid in there. This Polaroid is actually from like, that must have been, sorry, I've just taken my ring off by the way, because I don't want to get it that? caught. That was, that must have been 2017, that Christmas. Oh, when you got me the flat cap. Yeah. So yeah, I just always think it's a really cute idea to do. It's also nice like if you don't have someone anymore in your life, you know, like they passed away or something, to put a little picture of them in there, it's quite nice. Um, and then, oh, I love these little angel wing baubles as well. These are from Cox and Cox. Um, I also really like putting like things like this on the tree. So these are like, again, I don't think they're really designed to be baubles, but they're like mirrored stars and they just look so nice because they reflect the, um, what do they reflect? The lights on the tree. So yeah, they always look really nice. I can't remember where I got them actually, but I'm sure you guys find similar. Got some mistletoe. Do you want to come give me a kiss, Sam? Nah. Alright. There you go. <laughs> oh. You're getting a bit hot. Um, what other baubles do we have that I really like? These ones again, these are from m and so I love mirrored ones because I just feel like they make such a nice light. Um, what's this one? Oh, do you know what? Oh, so you do want to kiss. Uh, Raph, no. No, 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 uh, This, do you remember this one, Sam? Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Just heard it from there. But the camera can't see very well. Okay. I literally gave this to you last year, this is that way. Oh, yeah. I like this one. Oh, let me see it. Gaged. Oh, look, this is my absolute favourite. I think I got this off not on the high street. Hang on, let me see if I can get it to focus. It says engaged and then it says the date of our engagement as well. I love that, that's so special. Right, okay, shall we begin then? Yeah, I feel like I'm oh, I love these pom-poms as well. These are from Cox and Cox. These stockings are from West Elm as well, ages ago, but West Elm actually do some lovely stockings. So I got them and then I also got um, these stocking holders because I never know what to stick the stockings up with and we have like a bit of a curved fireplace so you can't use command strips. So I got these from Nkuku, I think it is. We also got this. This is like the little Manchester worker bee. I got this, sorry, excuse Raffi's squeaky toy. I got this at an um, antique shop, but I thought it was cute. Oh, hey, a little homage to Manchester. No one I love for Christmas. I just found the Polaroids that we took last year as well. Did you? Yeah, look. That one's like our engagement one. So cute. my time running around, keeping people pleased. But this is my favorite holiday. It's a chance to start over new. Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you. 
always had the good times with you Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh And I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh No, Sam, I'm going to hit the tree. No, I'm not going to hit the tree. No, it's all right. I feel like... Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Are you... You have to move your feet. Right, ready? I'm going to hit the tree. Come on. Sam, ready. I'm the tree's going to fall Three, over. Three, two, one. <laughs> So the tree is done. These two are just taking a little bit of a chill. Cuddle, yeah, we're just having a lovely cuddle. But yeah, here is the tree in all its glory. I love it so much. It is so nice. <gasps> I wish I'd done this sooner now, but yeah, absolutely love it. <laughs> and now I need to tackle this mm. fireplace. Fire as well, yeah. Hey, Raph. <laughs> we tried to do some Polaroids, but they're not really working. Um, I think we're a little bit too close to the camera and it might be a bit dark, maybe. This one of Raffi and Sam's really, really cute. I don't know if you can see, but they've got the mistletoe. So cute. <laughs> How have your Uggs been? Cozy? Yeah, I haven't taken them off yet. <laughs> yeah. Oh, love it. Gonna play those carols that you love We'll be singing all the melodies Until the sun comes up These are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making up I also have this like real foliage that I was actually sent in a PR package so I'm gonna give this a go even though I don't know how long it's gonna last so I'll obviously probably have to switch this out especially because it's above the fire Probably gonna get a bit hot. What? I'm actually really shocked with that. I think it looks really like nice and uneven. Oh, <laughs> like obviously I've got the real foliage in there, which is going to die, but I can just replace it. It's not a big deal. Um, I'm shocked with that. Very, very shocked. 
I need to get some different candlesticks, I think, because I think the white ones are a bit boring, but hmm, not bad at all. I have one more of these to put in, but I just don't know if it might be a bit overkill. So my Zara order has arrived, my Zara home order. And do you know what? I miss filming in front of the Christmas tree so much. I feel like it just adds such a nice, like, depth to your background. Anyway, yeah, Zara home order here. I ordered some Christmassy bits. They actually have some really, really nice bits. So, wow, that is so much packaging. Look at all that. <laughs> right, okay. So, can I just say, this whole Christmas decor malarkey, it takes such a bloody long time because you've got to get all the stuff out, put it all on, tidy it all up. And at the minute, because of the Christmas tree going there, we have like a chair in the middle of the room that we just don't know what to do with because there's nowhere to put it because obviously when Christmas, it's not Christmas, it just goes there. But anyway, and that's Rafi's favourite chair and he is not happy about it. Anyway. Right, I ordered some baubles uh, because we were originally going to do a second tree in the kitchen because... I just feel like this is the only room that gets like Christmassy and I kind of feel like, I don't know, it would be nice to have another room that does. So we were going to do a second tree in the kitchen, but after doing this tree, we're a bit like, oh God, I don't know if we can do another one, but we'll see. We might just get a small one. Um, so, oh, they are so nice. I am actually a little bit obsessed with stars around Christmas time or just stars in general, but especially around Christmas time. Um, they always make me think of my mum, <laughs> but yeah. Oh, how nice is that? That's gorge. Love that. Oh, that would look lovely somewhere on the tree, but there's not really much space for it now, so I might have to do some rearranging. So I got that. I think I got three of them. And then I got these ones, which are like a metallic-y crackled ball. Let's see if it'll focus. Yeah. So I got them. Oh, they're really cold because they're just outside. And then I got these ones, which looking at them, I'm not 100% sure on. They're very like reflective, but I did think they might be quite nice because and they'd like reflect the room. I don't know, but yeah, I got them as well. So yeah, they're kind of like they're kind of like mirrored. Oh, Rafi's coming with his Santa. <gasps> Do you want to show the vlog your Santa? Oh wow, look, let them see. Oh, lucky you. What's this? What is it? Is it Santa Paws? Is it Santa Paws? And then I also got some like little cute light up houses. I'm actually thinking I may need, I'm sorry. I'm actually thinking I might need to go out and get some more batteries. Let's get these little houses out. I just thought they were so cute. And I don't really have a lot of like Christmas ornaments. So I'm more of just like a tree and like garland kind of gal. But, oh, they're so nice. So this is the little house. Oh, how cute is that? And then it lights up, I believe. But I just need to, hang on. Oh, it's already got, oh my God, that is so cute. I love that. How cute. Do you know what, I'm gonna put it there for now. Oh, how lovely. Um, so I got that one and then I got, I basically got the full set. So it was like three of them in a set. And I thought they'd just look really nice, like put together somewhere. And then they're so like classic and timeless. I feel like I'll just keep them for ages, like every Christmas. Um, so then that's the medium size one. So we have these two together. How cute. Love that. Then I have a baby one. Oh. Do you know what? I actually don't want to vlog when he's doing that squeaky thing because when other vloggers do it, who've got dogs and stuff, it sends Rafi wild. So I can just imagine like people watching this video who've got a dog <laughs> and they're like, oh my God, please stop. Hi, gorgeous boy. And then this is the little baby one. Oh my God. Sam, how nice are these? What are they for? They just feel like decor. Do you like them? I think they were meant to go on the tree. Obviously not, but look, Sam. How cute are they? The well. Yeah, look, the smallest one's here. Oh, that's cute. Is it candles in it or lights? No, it's batteries, but they already done they've already put the batteries in for me. Look, watch this. Ready? Pull that out. Oh, turn it on. Oh, oh help. Yeah, no worries. Where am I gonna put them? Maybe over there. Oh, feeling very, very festive now, which I'm so excited about because I just wasn't feeling festive earlier, but then I actually saw on Lydia Millen's story that 
in order to feel festive, you have to actually do something. And I just thought, you know what? That's actually so true. I hadn't done anything. I was just like being miserable about not feeling festive, but I hadn't even tried to feel festive. Like I hadn't cut up my tree or I hadn't like, you know, put like festive candles or any Christmas music on and stuff. So, oh, little big cuddles. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna open up this side table as well because that's the other thing that I ordered. Okay, so I've got this side table for uh, for the lounge, the needed one. And for ages, we've just been moving another side table like next to the sofa, like when we need to put a drink down or whatever, which is just annoying. So, I found this one and I thought it looked nice. Oh, right. So, this is the side table. It's like this. It's kind of more of like a long stool, which is good actually, because then people can actually sit on it. Let's have a look. So annoying, it's just too low. Like that would be perfect if it was higher, wouldn't it? Because this space here is like a really awkward, skinny space, so it's really hard to try and find something that fits. But that is literally like a stool. Oh, what a shame. It's a really nice colour as well. Okay, that's going to have to go back. Oh, sad times. So excuse the mess that is the sofa, but these are our new prints, which we thought were so cool. All so right. yeah, we need to get them up, obviously, on the wall. Should all the acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should all the acquaintance be forgot and days of old lang syne? For old lang syne, my dear, for old lang syne. Talk a cup of kindness yet for days of old lang syne. And here's a hand, my trusty friend, and just a hand of thine. We'll talk a cup of kindness yet for all. I'm just lying here on the sofa, the fire is on, admiring my handiwork with the wreath and also looking at my Christmas tree. Oh, so nice. I love it. So I think I'm actually going to finish this vlog here because it's quite late now and we're probably just going to go to bed soon. The rest of our house looks like an absolute bomb site, but here is fine. <laughs> so yeah, as Sam literally said earlier, why does it feel like we've just moved in? Because I feel like there's like boxes everywhere and we also got takeaway earlier. So. It literally did feel like we'd just moved house. Um, and also we moved into this house around Christmas time. So I remember my mum and Sam were unpacking boxes and I was decorating the Christmas tree. Uh, so yeah, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.